Hello everyone. Today I'm going to start. I just pick up a top interview question. So today we are focused on strings. So this question actually is um, um say in first unique uh, character. So you will receive a, a string, but you need to find the first unique in here. If you say L E E T C O D E D the air already is the first unique one. So in here you if you see an L O V E L so L repeated is a zero one two the V did you see the V is the first unique one because the L be repeated O be repeated E be repeated L be repeated E repeated T has re hasn't been repeated, but uh, um, and the V is the first unique one. So it actually um just do a linear search. So every time you uh, find a character, you just uh, push in the hash map. If you find the one just uh, equal to one, then you just return. So that is what I'm thinking. So we just uh, write our code. So I have a hash say hash map. Then I find that then how how long I need a loop flow because I need a loop every body. Then only the unique one push it in. So I just find the lines. And in this loop, I just going to build it. So we will get the character. So this is my character chart. Once I get a character, this character, I just uh, put into my count. How much is me in the map? And every time. So the key, the key is this character, and then this map to the get O D F A U T default, and it is either is already exist or but default is zero. If a second time get it, um, every time I will get one, I just plus one. So if uh, like this after finish probably for this one E have a one two three four so the E will be four after words you already push into then you after words then you just looping full on this uh, again. So if only have a one, it means this one is the first unique one. Once I found this one, I just return this position. If after the loop I didn't find it, I just return negative one. And this is quite a simple solution. I talk about it. This is linear search is O N, and this is allocate a uh, space. So you need N space. Alright, just uh, put it. Okay, finish it, then we submit it. See if accepted. Yeah, it is accepted. Let's see the detail.
it uh, say one two four, but it uh, the run time actually take uh, twenty two milliseconds. So twenty two minutes except the run time. So my one is uh, quite uh, small. Yeah. So just let's think about it. How we can make it more quick? Um, in here I use a uh, hash map. But you see, he said that this is a uh, um, string character. And uh, so the, for the string character, you only will have a 26. So I don't need a map. I could use an integer array. And um, I add this number. See so how I can achieve it. I made it more faster. So another way, what I'm thinking. So if I don't use this, don't use map, don't use will be fast array it will be fast so uh, what i thinking so instead of use the whole this one how about I just use int because the maximum will be only need allocated 26 character because he said it only small letter and only contain 20 uh, and uh, for a character only have a 26 so for character only have a 26 but i still do exactly the same i'm looping for this one each character but instead of push it to array actually i push it to here the map is different so the map so, but i said this is integer. so the the later we are put in where actually use the trigger like this one this is the character. If I'm a character minus a, so it will, if it is a, this will put in zero. But if it is c, this character is cc. C. Character, character. This is my new character. So if it, the, this is my new character. So if this is a C, C minus A, it will be two. And in here, after I just plus plus. So every time, so I change this character, the C, the three position, to add one. Once I update this one, then I loop the character again. So going to instead the map to get you mm, don't have instead it is the map position also is the string of the character at either position you need a minus minus a start the index position start a position if you found this one is equal to one because by default they all will be zero then just return i Otherwise, you just return negative one. See, just let's test to see if I still don't have any syntax issue. See this fast, how fast it is. Okay, finished. If I submit it again, then let's see the tested. On this time, it's seven milliseconds. So it is much faster. So, and so just every time you finish a task, just think about is this the best solution? Um, so I simply the way I to do it exactly the same. What I did, I just use instead I use a um, hash map. I use the int array because I only need allocate 26 character. So by default, this 26 character from 0 to the and 26 character position, it will be 0. And then I loop each one. So each one map into the index. So you get the character, you minus this one, you will get the index value. Second time you find this one, you go into the index value, find this one is equal to 1 or not, it is. Then return one if you can't find it just return negative one and this solution is uh, much faster exactly the same way just change the uh, hash map to the uh, inter array so it also is a knowledge you learned so if you allocate a p 
pure into array and the small array, it will be much faster than you allocate a hash map. Um, thank you for watching.